A while ago I started this channel just for fun and around the same time I ordered a ESP32 with an OLED display online. Well, it arrived last week and let's use it today to have some fun with YouTube's counters and statistics. Now the ESP32 is not a board that is available in the Arduino IDE by default. I'll show you what I mean by that. If we go to boards, there is no ESP32 option. This means that we'll manually will have to add it to the IDE. To do so, we'll have to go to the Expressive GitHub page and you will find installation instructions on the page. Now, I'm using a Mac, so I will be using instructions for Mac. And it's simply just a matter of copying and pasting. I also have to install Xcode from Apple and this will take a while so just to speed things up we'll fast forward this bit. Now, once the download and install is finished, all we have to do is restart the Arduino IDE and let's cross our fingers and hope that the ESP is now a selectable board in the Arduino IDE. Yes, and there we go. Let's write some code to make sure we have everything correctly set up and we can actually drive the display. We'll start by including the SSD 1306 library and setting up an instance of this library. Let's name it Display. The SSD 1306 is a I2C device and its address is 3Charlie. And we will connect it to the ESP using pins 5 and 4. We'll paste in the rest of the code and before we will compile and upload we will check if we have selected the ESP as a board and we will verify if we are connected to the correct serial port. Compile and wait for the upload to complete. Now that the display is working I'll copy and paste in all of my code and we'll see if we can actually get some statistics from YouTube. But of course we have to recompile and upload. There you go, YouTube statistics on an OLED display. As you can see, not many subscribers and views, so if you like this video, like, comment or subscribe.